This is a video tour of the Pro Tools Dock Control Surface. The Dock is a hybrid controller utilizing U-Control software to communicate with any Yukon Aware digital audio workstation. It is also a dedicated dock for the Apple iPad running the Pro Tools Control app. On the back panel, it has a power supply port and switch, Ethernet connection, a power-only USB port for the iPad, and a quarter-inch jack for a software-assigned foot switch. The dock has a single fader, assignable jog shuttle wheel, soft keys, transport keys, and assignable touch strips. It also has a group of 16 multicolor LED soft keys that mirror the small soft keys on the control app. There are dual surface shift keys to add a shift function to all the soft keys. The 100 millimeter fader is touch sensitive with solo, mute, select key, and record automation mode key. It also has a 10 segment LED meter as well. The left edit soft keys are assigned to standard and advanced automation modes, the latching alt key enabling the advanced automation mode. There's also a soft key assigned to showing or hiding the automation mode window in Pro Tools. The transport keys are exactly that and can be reassigned to any preferred layout or function within the soft keys page on U-Control settings. The surface shift buttons on either side of the dock provide access to the shift functions of the transport keys. The labeling convention used on the dock, as well as the S3 and others, is the primary function is printed directly on the soft key, and the shift function is printed on the surface next to or above the soft key, usually with an inverted color space. The horizontal touch strip above the transport keys is a touch-sensitive strip with four assignable zones, sensibly labeled 1 through 4, and these can be assigned any Yukon command or keyboard command macro, all within U-Control. Pressing the Surface Shift key adds another four functions to the strip for a total of eight. You'll notice there is a vertical touch strip on the right side of the surface, and it has the identical capabilities of the horizontal touch strip, adding another eight total soft key assignments to the dock. The right edit soft keys are programmed for navigation and editing, as well as assigning functions to the central jog shuttle wheel. The OK and Cancel keys function as you would expect in Pro Tools, allowing you to accept or cancel any dialog windows that may open during sessions. The Save key is correctly named, and the Cancel button acts as an abort key if you decide saving is not what you want to do, since the Save key requires a second press to confirm and perform the Save command. All of the soft keys and touch strips are pre-programmed within U-Control for Pro Tools and other Yukon Aware DAWs and can be edited and saved as the user needs. To see a soft key assignment, press the Save and Cancel keys simultaneously to bring up the U-Control application on your workstation. From there, you can interrogate any soft key section of any attached U-Control device or confirm or change any soft key assignment. The iPad sits in the dock in landscape mode, and while running the Pro Tools Control iOS app, interfaces with U-Control via Wi-Fi or Ethernet and becomes part of the dock's control surface. Within the control app, there are four main views, Mixer, Tracks, Channel, and Soft Keys. The Mixer view displays eight channels of your DAW at a time, scrollable with a color-coded universe bar that displays the track colors of your session. At the bottom of the screen, you can display either transport keys or a set of 12 soft keys that are mirrored on the dock by the upper 12 LED-enabled soft keys. This bottom display is alternately shown by touching the bottom leftmost soft key mirrored by the soft keys area on the iPad. Paging up and down on the small soft keys is done on the far right soft keys, which is also mirrored on the iPad screen just above. These small soft keys are available in all four main views of the control app. In any main view, touching the dock fader brings up a status window on the control app, which displays track name, number, fader level, automation and rhythm status, and an audio meter. The tracks view displays up to 40 tracks at once, color matched to the tracks in the session, displaying track name, number, automation, and rhythm status. By touching a track, it is assigned to the dock fader and can be muted, soloed, put into record, or input. It can also be assigned to any automation mode simply by holding the automation mode key and touching the track or multiple tracks. You can select multiple tracks to assign modes or use the do to all soft key to affect all tracks. The channel view is where things get really interesting. You still have the track scroller with eight tracks displayed across the screen as well as the universe bar for navigation. Below these tracks is the parameter scroller with direct access to every detail of the selected channel. Inserts, input, dynamics, EQ, sends, panning, groups, mix, or output of the channel, and heat can all be displayed and adjusted in this view. 
accessing any parameter of an insert, panning in stereo or surround, assigning a track to a group or groups, instantiating a plugin or a send to the channel, assigning an input or output, it's all done here. If there are more than four quadrants of parameters shown in the center, just swipe to the next or previous set. Select bypass, prefader, Q versus frequency, all of this can be accessed simply, no mouse necessary. And the four encoders or knobs on either side of the dock correspond to the four parameter blocks on either side of the channel display. You can adjust a parameter from the slider on the iPad or use the encoder for more precise control. The soft key view is just that, soft keys galore. Starting with 150 pre-programmed pages of 24 soft keys per page for Pro Tools, putting at your fingertips over 3,500 shortcuts, Yukon commands, and macros to simplify and speed your workflow. The bottom right soft key on each page either alternates from mix edit screen or brings you back to the home page, which is replete with jump pages to access every mode of editing, automation, layouts, memory locations, anything you need to access or perform within your DAW. There are four user pages ready for customization, but there's no limit on how many user pages you can create and modify. The UControl app set of soft keys remains a constant throughout all your Pro Tools sessions, so any custom settings you make will be available for any session or project. The Universe Bar and Track Scroller are both available on the soft keys page view, as are the small soft keys. The Control Room Monitor Encoder adjusts control room level and monitor level in shift mode within supported applications. Be sure to see all the Avid videos on Yukon Aware surfaces and applications.